Good morning, everybody. I hope you're having a wonderful day. I want to welcome you back to the channel. I know it's been a really long time since I have made any videos, but a lot has changed in the last several months. Primarily, we decided we want to go more of a minimalist lifestyle. And since doing that, we have sold our home. We have gotten rid of most of our possessions. We have one very small storage facility and we upgraded our RV to a larger RV. We are on a summer vacation of sorts. We started off in Winter Haven, Florida and are heading to Fort Kent, Maine this summer and then back. Maine is where I'm from. Fort Kent is where my grandfather who's almost 100 still lives and a lot of my family. We are just going to have kind of like the summer vacation of our lives hopefully and visit a bunch of places we've never seen before and then when we come back to Florida we'll start talking and kind of figure out where it is we want to be and what we want to do but we definitely want to go more minimalist. We definitely want to downsize our home and I don't know maybe we'll do this full time but I'm not sure. I'm not going to commit to anything just yet. I just want to see how this summer goes. This next portion of my channel is going to be dedicated to exactly that. Now you're going to see a first two or three episodes that I do. They're going to be kind of spotty. I lost a bunch of video footage and I'm super sad about it, but I'm not going to cry. I'm just going to try and paste things together as easily as possible. And then hopefully after the, I think maybe like the third episode, then hopefully things will get back to normal. I'm really excited for this, this part of our journey. Roger and I have been through a lot both individually and together. I know if you've seen any of my older videos, you know there are some out there where I have dealt with mental health issues and just certain things along the way. I guess everybody goes through that stuff. I am trying to process and trying to work through those things. So I think a lot of it, the travel that we're gonna be doing has to do with that too. We're trying to figure out what's most important in our lives, what means the most to us, and at this particular point in time, we really have both discussed the fact that experience and time with the people that you love is for sure more important than what kind of car or how many cars we have and what kind of house we have. And we're kind of like starting over. It is a midlife crisis for both of us. And I'm really excited to see where this next journey takes us. So if you're interested in, at all in following along, please do like and subscribe. I will see you again very soon. But in the meantime, here's the next episode. So we are in the process of leaving this park. We have been in, I think it's called Hammondale RV Park for the last several weeks. In the meantime, we decided to take our RV and go on a huge summer trip. And we will deal with finding a home later. Oh, there's Roger. So he dropped the last of the stuff off at storage. Today is going to be day one of starting our new trip. I will show you once everything is open again and you know I've got all my stuff for traveling kind of lumped together in big piles. But um, I will show you what the inside looks like at some point. also forgot to mention in order to tow this bad boy we needed to get a different truck so there are lots of new things in our lives Santos Trailhead State Park in Florida. I think we're in Ocala. This campground is 
amazing. I am so glad we stumbled on it. Originally, I tried to get a campsite at Silver Springs State Park, and of course it was full. This campground is only about eight miles away from Silver Springs State Park. It has, uh, I believe, I haven't really looked up too much on it, but really good uh, biking, uh, horseback riding trails in through this area. And it's a really small campground. There's water and electric hookup and a dump station. About 25 sites. And it's basically just one loop around. It's one way. And some of these sites are fantastic. They do allow horses here, uh, tent camping. I am so glad we're here. This sure beats being in an, you know, like a busy squished in together RV park. Now I feel like we're camping. You can hear the bugs, you can hear mother nature around me. It just feels so good. I feel so relaxed. As soon as we got here last night, I just said, I finally feel like we're starting our summer vacation. I'm really happy to be here. So the whole reason for us being here is to go to Silver Springs. I've never been to Silver Springs. I really wanna do a glass bottom boat ride and check out the park. in Ocala, Florida, Silver Springs has been a destination since the late 1800s. There is tons of walks you can do around the water to different sites, different gardens. It's all like at your own leisure, but it's really, really cool. boats are the highlight of this trip. I have never seen anything quite like it. Our boat captain was a wealth of information and the views were outstanding no matter where you sat in the boat. one of the best things I've ever done. That was the 30 minute tour. Really reasonable, I think it was 12 or $13 a person. They also have an hour and a half a more in depth tour. Just remember at the end to bring some cash to tip the boat captain. And uh, it was awesome, I would do that again in a heartbeat.